All right. Um, so just to explain the context of this video, this is Liam. I'm usually on the other side of the camera. Um, however, I assume there's going to be a big controversy tonight. So on Friday, Hanks had the most dominant Mount Rushmore win of all time. However, he cheated and it was actually me who did it. So the Mount Rushmore of pizza toppings. We're going back to basics. And also on Wednesday, Big Cat told everyone else when we filmed it that they should throw it. Uh, let's go. Let's go, Hank. This way, I think I can get what I want on on the on third. The, on the comeback. Yep, I'm starting. Hank, you start. Pepperoni. Fuck. Okay. So as of right now, everyone knows that they cheated, but they don't know the other person cheated. So we're gonna talk to everybody about it. What are your thoughts on Friday's Mount Rushmore? Props to Hank. I have to go back to the history books, but I bet that this is the most lopsided victory in the history of the program. Five years strong. No, this is year six. You guys, what, 2016? Yeah, year six. So tip of the cap to him. <laughs> I think it just shows that a lot of people out there have like the, the taste of a second grader. And Hank's all meat celebrity meat pizza uh, was a big smash hit, but I think that what Big Cat and I showed was that we have a more refined palate. Pineapple gang, stand up. What about double olives? Double olives. Okay, so the double olives, <laughs> that was kind of a panic move. I probably should have not done olives back to back, but the fact is, if you have green olives and black olives on a pizza, that's, it's almost too much flavor, which is maybe why people didn't vote for it. Mm -hmm. Do you think the truth comes out? I don't know. If it does, I won't be the one to spill it, that's for sure. <laughs> All right. I don't know. I, I, I like I can't tell if they're gonna if they're gonna say it or not. It would be if and when they say it, it'll be denial. From Hank. Do you think I don't know though. Do you think he he has he has any idea? I'm sure he's seen tweets, because there are yeah. a lot of people that were catching on to it. My wow. books were terrible. I think I actually finished second with 5% of the vote. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, silver medal. So, Henry, Friday's Mount Rushmore, the biggest victory of all time. Yeah, so it's Sunday, Sunday uh, night here in the PMT studio. Uh, I've had a tough Mount Rushmore season. Really, really tough. Uh, I know I was pushing back on the podcast the other day, being like defending my answers, but even myself after the cartoon one had a, had a moment of reflection was looking in the mirror like, what are you doing, man? Like, get it together. Get it, like, what are you doing? Just what are you doing? So Liam, my right-hand man, I, I hit him up. I was like, Liam, I need you to pick my picks on Friday. I just need to see if it's me that's the worst picker in the world. Or maybe people are just like, you know, think it's funny to gang up on me and, like, vote for other people. We did this on Friday. Lo and behold, Liam had the most overwhelming, <laughs> biggest margin of victory in the history of Mount Rushmore. Like, not even close. Not... Not only did he not lose, did I, I, did I not lose? It was quite literally like 87%, 3%, 4%, 5%. I don't know if that adds up. But that was the margin of victory. Uh, Big Cat and PFT don't know. Honestly, there were so many people that were like tweeting and like posting and commenting like this had to be fake. They had to have thrown it. Like it's starting to get in my head. What? What, Hank? I literally nothing. I am literally looking at my list, like not. I didn't make a facial expression. Yes, you did. I just saw, you did went, you make a list for this one. Yeah. Okay. Hank literally just went like this. No, no, literally no. I, Hank's got to tell. You guys he just are took like, out an Oreo and he listened to it. You guys are like trying to. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. I. I Okay, all right, all right, let's all right, keep going. I'm literally just like... Let's keep going, let's keep going. Just, okay. I'm just okay. existing okay. in the studio okay. and everyone's okay. coming so, out okay. my neck. So many people said it that it got in my head, and I think that when we start to record, they're going to be like, Hank, we threw it on purpose. Like, that's why Billy picked Oregano, and Big Cat was like... Because <laughs> someone was like, you have to think Big Cat threw it. He went, I'm going to pick sautéed onions. Like, and that got in my head. That comment got in my head. I can't believe this lasted this long. I'm going to take uh, sautéed onions. They're going to maybe reveal that they threw it and then I'm gonna reveal that like Liam is now the Mount Rushmore guy. We're trying to gas up a bro. That's all. Hank was down bad. He's gone through a bit in the last couple of weeks. Um, he doesn't have the August abs that he said that he was gonna get unfortunately. I thought that really had a chance. So you know we just we kind of served him up a meatball. No pun intended. Um, I thought he knocked it out of the park. He could have blown it. Like it's not like we made the picks for him. He could have screwed it up. What was it? He had like 90% or something? Yeah, it was I like 88%. 
It was like, I don't know, like a week and a half ago, or maybe it was a week ago. I first texted the wrong Jake. I texted my friend Jake, and he was like, what are you talking about? I texted PFT Billy and the wrong Jake. And I was like, hey, we should uh, you know, pick up our boy and give him an easy one. And then my friend Jake texted me on the side and was like, why the hell did you just text me this? Uh, but then we figured it out, and we got it all set. Do you think he knows right now? So uh, he's, he's, about to, he's about to come in in like 15 minutes or so. I think he probably has an idea, but he also, it's like one of those things, you just, it's like running with the wind. You're like, man, I'm fast today. <laughs> well, the wind was behind your back there, Hank. You know, maybe like a hurricane wind. But you still ran, right? Like PFT said, he still picked him. Right, at the end of the day, he could have screwed it up. We yeah. can't, we weren't holding his hand throughout the entire process. He's just running with the wind, with a really strong wind. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see yeah, it, was, it was, it was, it was, you know, you'd think, you'd think it was a great weekend for me being like, yeah, like, fucking dominated, I'm back, I'm back. So many people. I've had a lot of stuff going on this summer. I've never seen as many responses to, to like, anything I've ever done uh, than this Mount Rushmore. You were trending. I was trending. Trending. <laughs> just people, like, having my back being like, you're back, good job, good work. And it was just literally nothing to do with me. I Liam sent me a list, and it was like... It was literally like playing Keno. I don't know if this is even a thing that other people do in other states. It was like playing Keno and playing 20 games of Keno, going over 20, and then you're just sitting there, like, and you're just too lazy to get up, and then you just watch all five of your numbers come up, and you're just like, what the fuck? I was just sitting there with a list, and it was like, one, two, three, four. Like, I never had to, I never even had to deviate from the one, two, three, four. It was insane. I don't think that's ever happened. It's never happened for me. Sausage? Wait. I don't know how that got back to me. I thought they took sausage. What is no, your no, first no. pick? Oregano. Oregano. <laughs> Fuck. I took ham. Okay, okay. Isn't ham the same thing? Yeah, I fucked that up. And I have that written down. I fucked that up. Barbecue up. chicken. <sighs> Fuck. Okay. okay. <laughs> I uh, honestly hope that Hank comes in and he's like talking shit about how great this Mount Rushmore was. <laughs> he's like, "Fuck you, fucking idiots." Y'all don't know shit about pizza. So, we're going to find out. I mean, it's going to be an interesting show, one way or the other. <laughs> it could be both ways, but, yeah, that's that's the that's where we're at tonight. Sunday night. <laughs> How do they look? How do they look? They get both Honestly, the like, yours, yours looks the best. BFT's looks the worst. Dude, mine doesn't look so bad. No, that's good. Well, that's well, not bad. Mine looks awesome. <laughs> I mean, Hank's just looks Hank's amazing. Hank's looks gross. <laughs> it actually doesn't look yeah, that good. No, <laughs> Wait. I actually think mine looks the most appetizing. What is the light meat? Back up. What's the light meat? Ham. Ham. But that's not... No, no, I got ham. Yeah, I don't know why they put ham on They put ham on Hank's? There's no barbecue... No, there's no barbecue. buffalo chicken. Yeah, yeah no barbecue chicken. No, there's, there's barbecue chicken. Right? Where? What's like the shame? Oh, bacon. What? This is real man's pie right here. Gotta have black and green olives. And mushrooms in hand. One hour later. Uh, Mount Rushmore. Mount Rushmore of items you would buy for $20 or less. Uh, Hank, do you want to do first because you're coming off a big win? Yeah, I gotta, I gotta tell you guys something. First of all, can we just... I was in my own head because there was an overwhelming amount of comments telling telling me you guys threw it. No. Mm -hmm. All right. I didn't think so, but it was one of those things where I we thought should have been basking in the win this weekend. Obviously, it was the most overwhelming for those that obviously it's a podcast. We put out the poll on Twitter. The results were like 84% me, 3% PFT, 3% Billion Jake, 4% Big Cat. So the most overwhelming win in all time. You would think I'd be celebrating, happy for it. You were trending on Twitter. Why weren't, why weren't I you happy? I was trending on Twitter. <sighs> on Wednesday, after the cartoon characters draft, I know I pushed back on the show, but uh -huh. even myself, had, in a moment of reflection, I was like looking in the mirror like, what are you doing? What are you thinking? What's going on Get right it now? together. Like, make better picks. Yeah. I texted my, my, my right-hand man, my partner in crime, Liam, and I was like, Liam, you're doing my Mount Rushmore Friday. What? It was, it was Bubba's Mount Text Rushmore? Text me a list. I'm just going to read your list. I'm not going to do anything on my own. And then I'd need to see if people, if I'm actually making these terrible picks, <laughs> or maybe people are just like so voting you me in last place. So it wasn't you? 
And it was those you were cheated. Liam sent me a list. You what know, the fuck? You, but I told him. I told him. I was like, Liam, if you All win, right. you've wait, def- no, hold on. Here's what you I said. Completely here's what I said. ruined Mount Rushmore. No, 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 no. You defiled no. the integrity of the finish? competition. Can I finish? Nothing left now. Can I finish? I, I told we just Liam. My first of all, season, big cat. I told Liam. I was like, if you, if I win, you're. I'm passing the torch. It's Liam's Mount Rushmore. I'm giving up my spot because clearly I'm doing terrible. All right, hold on. And clearly Liam. Made the greatest Mount Rushmore draft of all time. So not even close. We got to hear from Liam because Liam, you're the you're the uh, what's what's the omniscient omniscient uh, narrator? narrator. You're the omniscient narrator. Omnipresent. Right now. Omnipresent. Having his list and watching it unfold was so. Hank doesn't know what that word means. No, obviously uh, not. Okay, because Liam knows that you he you did his picks or Liam did your picks. Mm-hmm. Obviously, Liam also knows other things. All right, so I found out Wednesday. All right, so okay. you guys you, did fix it. No, no. no. he knows yes. other things. We, we thought that the fans were fixing the vote. Yeah, because they fucking, we thought the fans gassed you up so much that they just were like, all the AWLs were like, hey, we're going to vote for Hank. We thought there must be like a Reddit thread or a there back channel. Ha- it's bullshit. A, gr- a hype group. There's no way you win 88% of the vote. It wasn't me. What what else does Liam know? Yeah, we fucking threw it, dude. Are yeah, you serious? Did you actually yeah. think we you? didn't get sausage on the background? <laughs> you think well, I, no, that's what you I said. On the right. wraparound? You, think you, I you, forgot you guys ruined Mount Rushmore. <laughs> <laughs> now, you like, guys <laughs> both <laughs> told me. You guys, <laughs> we all ruined it. Yeah. You, got, you guys At both told me time. that you were cheating within <laughs> five minutes of each other where I thought I was getting fucked with. <laughs> like, I told memes. I had to be like, I was like, yo, what should I do about this? So I was like... Because I, I was thought, thinking, I was like, I might make one even worse than this. There were two to, like, moments fuck with you. where I was like, how does Hank not realize it? One was when Sausage got back to him, and two was when PFT went back-to-back all. I went double all. <laughs> well, I was just reading Liam's list. All right, so you guys have actually ruined Mount Rushmore. No, uh, no we got you a win. It. it felt good, but unfortunately... It didn't feel good because you also ruined it. Well, we can, no, no, but see, like, I, won, I was but just yeah. I, he asked me to do it. Yeah, you know what this reminds me but of. Like that, but like that, you guys, but you guys saying like we're just, like I'm, I, I'm not doing my Rushmore. Period. What are you talking no, about? No. You ruined it too. We both no, ruined no, no, it no, 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 no. Someone else. No, 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 no. I employed a strategy. I was always gonna say. Like this is a new strategy, and we were always gonna say we did it so that you'd have a nice weekend. But that's and fucking yourself up. that's so lame. That's like <laughs> the fucking lamest thing I've ever heard. Hank, you no. guys are fucking losers. No, Hank, listen to me. This is it's kind of a beautiful what thing that we both cheated at the same no, no, time. No, I did not cheat. Yeah, you, you guys, no, you, you guys just actually but ruined this. No, you cheated. No. Hank, it's beautiful. It's like you know the song. Do you like pina coladas? It's about a guy writing a personal ad trying to cheat on his wife and his wife also writes a personal ad trying to cheat on her husband and they answer each other's ad yes. and end up hooking up again. Yes. That's what this podcast was it is. on Friday. We both we all parties cheated at the exact same yeah. time. I think it's, it's meant to it's, be it's, it's to different. try no, no, it's not. You it's, had someone else do your picks for you. We might have said beforehand, let's make sure Hank wins this one so he can fucking feel good about himself. That's so lame. Why? Just bros gas and bros. Yeah.